The Blue Hole is a famous deep sinkhole approximately five miles north of Dahab on Egypt's Sinai Peninsula. It's very popular for recreational and technical divers, as well as freedivers, swimmers and snorkelers. The varied depths, conditions and entry points offer something for everyone. The drive to the Blue Hole takes approximately 15 to 20 minutes and is a very scenic and pleasant drive along the coast. On arrival, there are various shops, cafes and restaurants. These make an ideal hangout for in-between dives. You can leave your gear safely and chill with delicious food and drinks. The area comprises several dive sites. You can enter into the Blue Hole fairly easily from the shore in front of the restaurants. But our favourite is to walk a little further up the beach and enter at the Bells. The Bells is a narrow canyon that descends down to around 30 metres. From here, you can dive along the reef towards the Blue Hole and swim back across the saddle, which is a fairly shallow dip in the reef linking the Blue Hole with the open ocean. The light penetration brings to life the beautiful and colourful corals. The inside of the hole itself is not as vibrant, but great for deep dive training and for freedivers. The infamous archway, which is perhaps the main reason for the Blue Hole's reputation as a dangerous site, has sadly claimed many lives over the years. This makes a great dive for technical divers, but should not be attempted by recreational divers with insufficient experience, equipment or training. Free divers also love to enjoy the Blue Hole as the depth and proximity to the shore make it ideal for training. In my opinion, the Blue Hole is not the dangerous place it's often made out to be. When you stay within the limits of your training, the Blue Hole and the Outer Reef offers some of the best shore diving anywhere in the world. Just take a look at the magical underwater world that awaits you here.